So, a couple of things, right? One is try and get in the habit. Sticking my knee, my foot right up my butt, like that, yeah. Because when your knee is away from the person, now they can drop their hips down like this and curl their hips, and they want to sit really heavy on my hips like that. It makes it very hard to try and escape, yeah, right. And usually the first thing you're going to try and probably do from here is to move his weight forward, yeah. So I always stick my foot right up my butt there, so he sits on my on my thigh, like that, yeah? Which stops him going back and down any further. So I can kind of lock him between that leg and my arms here like this. Then I can start walking my foot out a little bit, start pulling his feet apart and things like that, right? Now, just with what we did, keeping it real simple, right? So the person has a hand on my collar, I don't stress, yeah, right? I start with a hand behind, hand on top, this is classic bridge and roll here like this, like that. So I'm owning his arm, I can trap his foot. When the person puts their hand in my collar, my first response is to block their foot. Yeah, I don't, I don't wait because like now he knows I'm onto him. Yeah, All right. So when I'm here like this, going even, even more defensive than what we just just did, right? So he brings the hand over to to, to choke. I'm going to bring his arms together here like this, then I can bridge and roll him off. But to be even more defensive, he goes over, I just put my hand against my cheek. Do the trick. So what I'm doing is locking my arm against his arm, not with my arm up floating in the air. I put my arm against his arm. So he's literally squeezing and creating the little frame that works in here himself yeah right so if you're a little scared of trying to grab that arm yeah you can just grab your cheek here like this and look my elbow since it sits against his arm yeah so I'm here he goes to choke me Yeah, right? So have a play with like being very defensive. And you can see exactly what I'm doing with my hips if he starts getting a little bit too close for me. Yeah, the hands on the collar. I'm here. My hand goes straight up, locking my elbow against his arm. I can just give him a little bump. Just move that arm out. Cool. Where we go. One, two, three. 